Believe it or not, the temperature of wine will affect the flavor a lot. Here I have a wine at about 62 to 68 degrees. Um, this is an ice cold wine, and this wine we had heating up on my stove. There's a lot going on with the flavor. I heat, feel it in the front of my mouth, all the way to the back and into my throat. I'm getting berry notes, boysenberry. I get this sort of floral thing going on. It's vanilla. Now, let's try the ice cold one. Firstly, I cannot smell. I can't, I can't smell anything in this glass. It tastes tart and sour. That is all I can tell. This wine that's been on the stove, it smells like blackberry jam, which, which actually smells pretty good. Okay, although it smelled really good, when I put it in my mouth, I get the initial burst right in the front, but it feels heavy, like a sack of potatoes on my, on my tongue. This is the same wine across the board and they taste remarkably different. So, just to recap, red wines between 62 and 68 degrees, optimal serving temperature, and white wines probably between 49 and 55 degrees. If you live in a house that's over 70 degrees, maybe put it in the fridge for 30 minutes before serving it. This is a red wine. And if you're serving a white wine and you've got it stored in the fridge, maybe pull it out 30 minutes before you're gonna serve it. <laughs> A lot of people have written us um, asking how to taste wine. What the hell is wrong with you guys? You don't know how to taste? Your tongue doesn't work? Like this. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's the stuff.